Welcome to the Curricular Practical Training Requests Overview. Here, you'll discover the eligibility, criteria, requirements, and the process for completing a CPT request through ISP. Curricular Practical Training, or CPT, is an opportunity for F1 students to gain work experience in their field of study while they are still enrolled as a student. To be eligible to apply for CPT, students must have completed at least one semester at PCCD, have an active F1 status, be making academic progress, have a 2.5 GPA or greater, have an updated student education plan, enroll in a course that requires CPT in its established curriculum, have an offer letter for employment that is directly tied to the major listed on their I-20, and have a CPT request approved by a DSO in CVIS. Next, I will go over the limits of CPT. There are limitations to CPT. CPT can only be authorized once per semester, either on a part-time or a full-time basis. Students can only work within the dates of the course. Students are limited to the employer submitted with the CPT request. Students can only begin working after being approved by a DSO in CVIS. Students must continue to maintain enrollment throughout the semester. OIE will authorize only two full semesters, fall or spring, and one summer CPT per student. Students with more than 60 transferable units may not enroll in CPT courses and request a final semester reduced course load during the same semester. If you are requesting a final semester reduced course load, students must enroll in a class that is required to complete a certificate, degree, or transfer requirements apart from a CPT eligible class. If requesting a CPT only semester, the student's SCP must indicate the number of transferable units and which requirement will be fulfilled with a CPT eligible course. To apply for CPT, complete the following steps. Number one, enroll in a cooperative work experience education course at Peralta. An example of that would be COPED 450 general work experience, COPED 451 occupational work experience. Number two, get an updated student education plan. Number three, obtain an employment offer. And number four, submit a CPT request in your international student portal. To find the CPT request, log into your student portal and click the International Student Portal tile. In your International Student Portal, find Student Requests and Documents, then click CPT Requests. Complete the CPT Eligibility Questionnaire and upload your student education plan and employment offer letter. Once completed, an advisor will let you know if your request has been approved, denied, or if we need any additional information. Thank you for watching how to request CPT.